I'm going to let all the political pundits in this town uh, have a long discussion about uh, what happened in the election. Now, it was a fascinating election, so I, I, you know, I'm sure there are going to be a lot of books written about it. Uh, I've said what I think is important for the Democratic Party going forward, rather than uh, try to parse uh, every aspect of the election. Uh, and I've, I've said before, I couldn't be prouder of Secretary Clinton, her outstanding service. I think she's worked tirelessly on behalf of the American people, and I don't think she was treated fairly during the election. Uh, I think the coverage of her and the issues uh, was troubling. Um, but having said that, uh, what I've been most focused on, appropriate for the fact that I'm not going to be a politician in about, was it 32 days? 31? 34? Uh, what I've said is, is, is that I can maybe give some counsel advice to the Democratic Party, and I think that the the thing we have to spend the most time on, because it's the, the thing we have the most control over, is how do we make sure that we are showing up in places where I think democratic policies are needed, where they are helping, where they are making a difference, but where people feel as if they're not being heard, and where Democrats are characterized as coastal, liberal, latte sipping, uh, you know, politically correct, uh, out of touch folks. Uh, we have to be in those communities. And I've seen that when we are in those communities, it makes a difference. That's how I became president. I became a U.S. Senator, not just because I had a strong base in Chicago, but because I was driving around downstate Illinois and going to fish fries and sitting in VFW halls and talking to farmers. And I didn't win every one of their votes, but they got a sense of what I was talking about, what I cared about, that I was for working people, that I was for the middle class, that the reason I was interested in strengthening unions and raising the minimum wage and rebuilding our infrastructure and making sure that parents had decent child care and family leave was because my own family's history wasn't that different from theirs, even if I looked a little bit different.